current through a metallic conductor. As we know, in a metal, the valence electrons are not attached to individual atoms, but are free to move about within the body. These electrons are known as free electrons. The free electrons are in random motion just like the molecules of a gas in a container and they act as charge carriers in metals. The speed of randomly moving electrons depends upon temperature. If the temperature around the metal increases, then the motion of these free electrons increases as well as the temperature around the metal decreases, the speed of these random moving electrons also decreases. If we consider any section of metallic wire, the rate at which the free electron passes through it from right to left is the same as the rate at which they pass from left to right. And same like the rate at which the free electron passes from top to bottom is the same as the rate at which they pass from bottom to top. Now, if the ends of the wire are connected to a battery, an electric field E will be set up at every point within the wire. The free electrons will experience a force in the direction opposite to E. Now our free electrons are ready to produce current in a metallic conductor. I hope now you can understand current through a metallic conductor through this animation. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more updates. Thank you.